Okay, Dr. Tatiana here. We're going to be showing you two quick little exercises. Please do not do both of these exercises unless both have been prescribed by your practitioner. So you'll see on your sheet it will say eversion or external rotation of the tibia. So there's two different options that you can do. What you're going to need for this exercise is a TheraBand. So I'm going to have Kayla follow me down here to my feet right now. So you're going to see the placement of the TheraBand. So I don't know if you want to come above. It might be the best view there, Kayla. So what you'll see is that I'm putting tension on the TheraBand. My toes are pointing straight ahead, but there's already tension. It's not loose like this, because if it's loose throughout the whole activity, you're not going to get the stretch or the eversion and the activity of the muscle that you need. So we're having a little bit of stretch. So if we're stretching, or sorry, if we're strengthening the right foot, we're slowly, this is external rotation. Notice how the foot is just moving outwards. We're just moving from the tibia. And then we're bringing the foot back in nice and slowly. So once again, this is external rotation of the tibia. If you want to do eversion, what I'm going to have you do is focus on this right foot. What's happening now is that the foot is coming up and out on an angle. So we're actually contracting all of these muscles up the side. So once again, this is eversion, up and out and coming back up and out and coming back, and the external rotation of the tibia. The foot stays nice and flat and parallel to the ground. Do you see the difference there? Perfect. So make sure that you're doing the reps and sets prescribed by the doctor and the holds prescribed by the doctor. If you have any questions or if you're not sure if you're supposed to be doing both of these exercises or either or, please speak to your practitioner.